It's August 28th, which also happens to be National Bowtie Day. Did you know? Whether you love this style for its retro cool factor or quirky connotations, today marks the one day a year when the bow tie reigns supreme. When it comes to tying the perfect knot, though, bow ties can be tricky. A resident bow tie expert, Toy Thornton, is making an appearance to show us how he ties a bow tie. So, National Bow Tie Day, yes, there is a thing, and we have the bow tie expert. Toy Thornton. Hashtag news guy with bow tie. I want you to talk about bow ties. Let them take it over. So I have <laughs> a fascination and a love for bow ties. I call myself a bow tie aficionado. Um, and this is just my bag of goodies that I carry around every day. Everyone was very surprised when they saw it um, because this is not something you see quite often. I was impressed. He has this like at his at his desk, and I'm look at this, right? Oh, bag of bow ties. How many? I don't know. It's a innumerable number. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I don't know. So that, that's it. You know. Um, so I mean, are we gonna tie some bow ties? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Right. I've got I've got my bow tie. See, <laughs> it's a it's a tie. And I, I gotta do one of these. <laughs> so, so there are different kinds of bow ties. There are pre-made. This is one pre-made one. I have a rule. I don't wear pre-made bow ties unless it's something special. So th this is a little bit different. My husband's getting into bow ties, hey. so that's why I'm starting to know this. I need to hook him up with you. Yeah. Teach us how do we tie. All right. Well, first of all, you have to have that top button tied, and just like a normal tie, you. Flip that collar up, and then you take your tie. This is one of my favorites, so I'll do this one. You're gonna put it on around your neck. You take the long one, you put it over the short one, like so. And then you're gonna create like a little V, bring that long one up and through the V, and just a regular small knot, single knot. And then you take the left side, the short one, and you form a bow tie, okay? Then you take the long one, bring it around town, flip this one, make butterf butterfly wings, and you gotta find a hole. This is the tricky part for some people. You find the hole inside of there. Sometimes it's not really a hole, you gotta make it though, with your finger. Then you take this side, and you stuff it on in there. Stuff it on in there, and then you take it and you just adjust it a little bit. And then, boom, got right. a bow tie. Now, this one was just left a little longer, so it's a little bit bigger than your average bow tie. But, it... Look at this guy, look at this guy. Mm. Sharp, now, there's all another the way. time. One small step is when you bring that long one through, you bring it through twice, it makes it a little more crisp, more firm, it won't move as much. Yeah. I leave that step out when I'm rushing, mm -hmm. which is why sometimes on there you see me with a crooked bow tie <laughs> like that. <laughs> but if you do that step, it kind of stays straight a little more. So. Sweet! Tie. Now obviously it would be different if I were tying it on you. It would be reverse, yes? Yes. Okay. I haven't right. mastered how to Perfect. do that. <laughs> yeah. Well, nor have I. I'm not doing that. Thank you, Tua. You're welcome. Good job. And now you know.